Governor Linda Lingle has taken offense to a television ad that says she distort that she says distorts the record of her administration. She's calling on the Democrats to pull it off the air. KITV 4s Catherine Cruz was at the governor's news conference and joins us now with more. Catherine. Well, if you were thinking that the governor hasn't been very visible with her lieutenant governor's campaign for the top seat, she certainly came out with strong words today over an ad that she characterizes as an 11th hour smear. Duke Iona in the governor's chair? Not when he did nothing when Aloha Airlines crashed, leaving 3,000 of our neighbors out of work. Not when his administration violated the law, sinking the super ferry. The ad certainly hit a button with the governor. The assertion in this Democratic Party smear piece that uh, we did nothing while Aloha Airlines was facing these problems is simply uh, false. It's a lie. It has no basis in fact, and they should take this ad down immediately. Lingle says the ad couldn't be farther from the truth. She rattled off a list of steps she took to help Aloha, including an unprecedented move by the Labor Department to help workers after the abrupt shutdown, as well as a major effort to save Aloha air cargo jobs. The second point that they made in their ad said that our administration did nothing while the super ferry failed. And again, it's just a blatant lie. I disagree with that. We don't think it's a smear at all. We think that it's uh, right on. These ads, we believe, are uh, very clear. I uh, enunciate exactly what happened during the Lingo Iona administration record. And literally, the ads speak for themselves. And Lingo maintains she included Iona in vital policy talks, valuing his background as a lawyer and a former judge. He was with me in all major decisions. He didn't necessarily agree with me in every decision, but the two I mentioned to you today, he was certainly a part of all discussions. Lingle also called in Senator Dan Inouye and Neil Abercrombie to get the ad pulled. If Neil Abercrombie had any character, he would condemn this ad. The Abercrombie campaign says it would defer to the party. And Democrats held a big rally on Maui, which is where Carpenter, Abercrombie, and Senator Dan Inouye were tonight. Iona was also there campaigning earlier in the day in this last push toward the election. Paula?